Hello guys, hope doing well. Today I finished the project in skin resistant measurement. So you can see I have this project on bread burden after this I'm going to uh, make a PCB seeker to print out exactly and I will design the layout printing sheet for the um, best quality result for skin resistance test or measurement so this is the um, schematic that I take from Google so it's coming with two parts the first part is this side making exactly one volt to inject the voltage to the pin number three and the next one is sensitive MCP6002 this IC need to bypass filter but I don't know exactly why this one made for this skin resistant test type of measurement but this one will work pretty well when the input resistance from the skins coming to the pin number two the first negative pin of operation amplifier and you can see that I made by three different type of diodes here to make that exact one O two four volt. I need one O four capacitor to short with the negative. I have the uh, I'm using the big version. You can see that is a one O four. It's connected to the negative, and the negative pin is connected by ten kilo ohm resistor to the diodes and these three diodes will make 1024 volt 1.024 volt exactly to connect the pin number three of IC it's positive first channel of operational amplifier and also I replaced the diode with one buzzer because of I have a lot of noise here, I have too much electronic equipment here and my diode I'm not able to check exactly what's going on and you can see that I replaced the diode and 220k protector resistor here by one oscillator without using the 220 protector resistor so the thing that we should know exactly we need to regulate it low noise 5 volt output I use the fresh 5 volt converter and connect it to the 9 volt fresh battery and the output of 9 volt uh, 5 volt converter is connected exactly to breadboard you should know with the um, AC to DC converters like this and the power supply we are not able to take exact result because of we have a lot of noise with this kind of um, DC power supplies even you connected the ground pin but find this kind of uh, 5 volt regulators it's very easy and simple to measure exact output of the skin resistor. So the thing that we should know is uh, I'm using the uh, 12 volt car charger module for this one and it is working pretty well with the low noise and very good usage coming with MC IC this version is a Chinese but working pretty well so to test you can see the electrodes should connect to skin and the other electrodes should connect to the 5 volt incoming battery the 
power source exactly should be the same incoming power if you're using the different power source you will not take the answer and the result is negative but now you can see the um, voltage 1 volt voltage injecting to the pin 3 is um, connected by jumper wire but for the PCB version I will fix it with the other position so you can see when I'm touching these two probes you can see exactly the Bose working good and I think if I change these two props with um, skin resistance sensor is something like 20 bucks eBay or Amazon and with the relax position we are able to check the resistance this resistance depended to the um, uh, depended to a lot of uh, items so it is the um, blue category or the weight or the age everything is different but it's coming from 100 kilo uh, to 380 kilo ohm is completely different and you should know if you are touching any power source like this or touching the ground or using the shoes or using the um, any electronic equipment with you the answer of the skin resistance test tail is completely different when you are touching the props and during this touching when you are connecting the other hand to the ground you can feel exactly the buzzer oscillator will change the effect and also I'm sure that with a lot with a small um, tuning you will find how big is your skin resistance so should know after shower not a good time to take the skin resistance thanks for watching let me know your ideas about this project thanks also special thanks for the guy that made this schematic and goodbye